It's 6 p.m., which means it's time for Fire and Ice. We've got 100 player picks. Let's see if we can get ourselves some of these brand new promo cards. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Ultimate Team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. If you're new to, to FC and you don't know how this promo works, effectively, it works where you've got two versions of each card um, and you can get either version. You've got, for example, striker Neymar or left wing Neymar, and their stats are different depending on their position. So we've got 100 player picks, hoping to get ourselves some of these brand new cards. I've got to say, the card designs, once again, absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely sensational. If anyone at EA needs a raise, it's the design team. They've absolutely smashed it once again. You know, it's it's. I'm glad they can get something right. That's what I will say. I'm glad they can get something right. But yeah, the, the card designs are absolutely fantastic. So hopefully we can get ourselves some fire and ice cards. Fingers crossed. Or they call it versus, but it is fire and ice. Let's be honest with ourselves. Uh, but they call it the versus promo. Um, so fingers crossed we can get ourselves some versus cards. I mean, Neymar looks absolutely fantastic. Uh, Son looks ridiculous as well. Uh, even to be fair, like Sergio Ramos has not got a bad card. I think I, like, I'd probably use Sergio Ramos if I packed him. I'd probably give him a go because he would fit my team. So let's see if we can get any of these cards, EA. I'm wondering as well if we're going to get a tell when we get them in picks. Like, for example, previous uh, promo cards in picks, they kind of push out. But these ones don't look like they push out of the cards. So I feel like we won't know. Inform Tati Castellanos is decent, though. We'll take that. I feel like we won't know if we pack one until it just actually appears. So I guess I kind of like that. Adds more suspense. Anyway, I'm not going to make you watch every single one of these player picks, even though we get ourselves an inform Mavropanos now, which is nice. Great header against Arsenal. Uh, I won't sit here and make you watch every single player pick. We'll be back when we get ourselves, hopefully, a fire and ice card, if not just some decent cards. But we've actually been off to a really good start, to be fair. We're getting walkouts, getting informs. I'll see you guys in the next good pool. Oh, inform Ibanez. By the way... This card looks ridiculous. He was so good at the start of the year. Controlled lengthy, 89 pace, 86 defending, 85 physical. That card looks really good for an 84 rated in form. That's kind of crazy, man. If that card came out at the start of the year, he would have been so expensive because that, that guy in general was mad hyped. I remember looking at all like the starter squads at the start of the year and everyone had him in their squads. It was crazy. So that is, a, that is not a bad card. I unfortunately will not be using him. Let's go. We get our first versus card. We got ourselves Fire Marata. Four star skills, four star weak foot, six foot three. If he just had a bit more agility, a bit more agility and balance, this card would actually look really, really good. Being six foot three with 99 jumping, 96 heading accuracy. I mean, maybe he's just a powerhouse. He probably wouldn't be bad. That's solid, man. I love that card design. So you can tell a little bit by the card pu pushing out of the top. So, we, we, we will be able to tell a little bit. I'm happy with that. It's a good start. The first set has been really, really good. But long may it continue, EA. Long may it continue. Let's get some more of these fire and ice cards. We've just had three walkouts in a row. Technically, four walkouts in a row, including Murata. We're on a roll. Okay. McAllister had to ruin it, as usual. Come on, McAllister, man. You had to ruin it. Oh. Let's go. Piero informs are always appreciated. We've got four more left. Back to back informs. Brand new Spurs player, I think. I just saw uh, Fabrizio tweet about him, actually. Um, he said, Understand Tottenham have made new contact for Genoa, uh, with the Genoa, sorry, for, for Radu Dragusin. There you go. I've never watched him play before, but he looks like he's got a decent card on FIFA. <laughs> I feel like such a casual right now. That's such a casual way to say it. But um, I've never watched him play before. But. Uh, you know, maybe he's decent. Uh, I'll take the 86 rate inform though. That card looks really, really nice. We finish off the first 50 with a with one fire card, like four informs and a bunch of walkouts. That's actually an incredible set of 50. The pack look seems really good right now, so that's solid. Hopefully, it continues with the second set of 50. All right, on to the last five of the 100 player picks. The second set of 50 have kind of been a little bit, a little bit, a little bit quiet. I will say they've not been anywhere near as good, unfortunately, which is a little bit disappointing, but it is what it is. Um, you can't have good luck all the time. And the first set were very, very good. And we've had walkouts and stuff like that as well. Like, I can't complain. We've got ATA Endlo and people like that. Uh, so for SBCs and stuff, I'm going to do Sterling, I think. I'm not entirely sure which version of Sterling. Let me know in the comments down below which one you're going to be doing. But um, I will use my fodder for that as well. Um, oh, we have a couple of extras. Look at this. Imagine we get something good in one of the extras now. What are the tripled over ones? Go on. 
Never mind. Okay, right. Well, let's go over some packs then. So I saved a couple of packs as well. We've got an 80 times 10. Uh, we've got an 85 double and then my 100 player pack that I saved as well. I don't think it'll be worth it. I don't think that we'll get anything good in, in any of them. I'll be honest with you. I'm being a little bit facetious, a little bit boring, but I don't think we'll get anything good in any of them. But one can only hope. Now, I believe these are similar to Winter Wild Cards where they don't pop up as an animation and they pop up at the back of the pack. I think so boring, but you know, what can you do? EA, EA, B, EA sometimes. Oh, I've got discard another 86. I'll recover them at some point, but it hurts. It hurts discard 86. All right, 100 player pack. Come on. Let's get, let's get a fire or ice card, please. Germany, Cam, Muziala. If this is Thomas Muller, I'm, I'm throwing a controller. Maggle, one walk out. There better be a fire and ice card in the back. There better be something here, man. Oh, bro, please. Don't do me dirty like this, please, EA. Oh, Aaron Ramsey's a silver card. Oh, my God. Bakayoko. I bet he's still on loan at Chelsea, isn't he? He's still on loan from Chelsea. Anthony Alanga. Go on, lad. Sorry, I don't know why I get so caught up with all these cards. No fire or ice card at all, man. That's disappointing. Wow. So, of course, we got ourselves some store packs to open as well. So, we've got a brand new one. 300k or 1,000 FC points. Includes 50 rag old players, 81 or higher. Two guaranteed to be 86 or higher. And you've got a 14% chance at each a uh, fire and ice card. I mean, the front of that pack does look very nice, doesn't it? The front of that pack looks absolutely gorgeous. Again, the, the design team, it's sensational. All right. 1,000 FC points. Let's see what we get. Hopefully, there is going to be a... Fire or ice card in this. Courtois on the front. Double walkout. Nice. So, someone higher rated than Courtois is in there. Damka. Should probably get a team of the year as well, right? I'm I, Again, I'm not really clued up with women's football, so I don't really know. But she might get a team of the year. No fire or ice card, unfortunately. I'm hoping the Supreme Icebreaker pack has got one in store for us. Because that's not great. In terms of the loan, I don't really know... What's the difference here? Oh, significantly less agility and balance. And pace, I think. That's a shame. I must discard all of it. Close your eyes. I know it hurts. I'm discarding all of it. Supreme Icebreaker Pack. It's time. Come on, EA. Please, I'm begging you. Give me a, give me a fire ice. Give me give me an ice Neymar, please. Or a fire, whichever one the best one is. <laughs> give me a fire son. I'll take Mbappe. What? Who's that? Diani? Diani and who? I'm pretty sure, like, the likes of Putellas and Bappe and all those, they're, they're back in packs as normal gold cards now. So I guess we can look forward to trying to get those in packs, I guess. Hey, Inform Elise, please come to United, mate, please. Um, Inform Sakamoto, bit of, bit of fodder. Hey, look at that. Oh, my word, that's weird. We've got the same version of Lorente in, in, in one pack. Did we, get, did we get Thingy as well? We did not get Murata in the dupes. I mean... You know, like, eh, I can't really get excited about that. But we got the same version of one player in one pack. That's the FIFA myth right there. Two 86 plus base or triple threat hero player picks. Now, if I remember from last week, there was no triple threats in these at all. So I hope that's different. It's not. You've got a choice of pretty much Bompastor or Viali. I think Viali is the obvious choice here. He's 89 rated. He's higher. Unless you have tradable king. If you've got a tradable king, then, you know. That's good, I guess. But, um, yeah, I think it's probably Viali is the pick there, unfortunately. Come on, let's get a triple threat right here. I reckon it might be similar this week to last week, where it is only base heroes in these picks. All right, my boy Rex has got a hero pick next. Let's see what we get. I'm... I can't be the only one that thinks that heroes are very boring. I don't get excited for a hero pack or a hero pick at all. There's no hype in heroes. Icons are exciting. Heroes, not so much. And it's just, that's why, man. You open a hero player pick and you get players that you just don't want to put in a team. Come on. Show up, EA. Show up. Be better. Be better this time. Give us a triple threat. As I was saying in the last clip, like, even getting like a... Oh, got two and one. There you go. Even getting like a base A Torre. I mean, it's okay, but there are much better cards that are, that are out nowadays, you know? Triple threat, yeah, yeah, it's better. That would be exciting. But that's probably the best one we've seen. That is definitely the best one we've seen so far. He got he got two triple threats in one. That is uh pretty impressive, if you ask me. Pretty impressive. Oops. Well, I don't know what I've just done there. 
He's opening a pack, I think, as well. 2,000 FC point global limit pack. What's this? I don't even know what this is. Argentina. Send it forward. Messi! It's Dybala. Maybe, maybe Messi's a double walkout. Could you imagine? That'd be really cool, actually. Like Argentinian friends, like World Cup winning friends, you know. Who's that? Who's that? It's Griezmann. It's Antoine Griezmann. Antoine Griezmann. Come on. EA, please. Right here. Show us. Fire and ice. All right, Lala's crazy. Lala's nuts. He's opening the 500k pack with coins. Oh, what's this? An inform. So he's got Casemiro. He's got Casemiro and an inform behind it. Who is going to be the inform? I can't remember this week's team of the week. I know Dragusin's in there. Who else is in there? Who's that? Rafa. Oh. Meh. 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 All right, what else is in this? Right, we've got three informs. And some fodder. Ooh, I think there's a, I think there's a fire ice because the player picks not that. Oh wait, this one doesn't have player picks in. Hey, you do have fire and ice. So we've got Zoko, uh, Radetzky, and Loriente. Uh, yay, yay. I don't know. All right, bunch of fodder packs here. So some exciting stuff coming. Hopefully, some fire and ice. And when I say that, hopefully one of them's name are... Got ourselves an inform here. It's an Argentinian striker named Tati Castellanos. We'll take it. You know, not bad. What else we got? Come on. EA, in these fodder packs, let's get some versus cards that pop off. That you can use in the team. I want to see Son. Son would be a nice one. Son, Neymar, Trippier, uh, Sergio Ramos, Camavinga... Any of those would be very nice, EA. None of the none of the rubbish ones we're getting at the moment. Any of those ones I just listed would be class, please. Absolutely class. All right. Come on. Next up, we've got ourselves an 84 times 5. Who are we getting in the front? It's going to be... Uh, it's a Spanish. My head hurts, man. My head hurts. It's been a long day. I've been awake for a very long time. I woke up quite early this morning. I've been doing a lot today. It's been a very long day. So apologies. My head hurts. But Trent and... Ooh, who's that? Oh, Mead. Okay. Morata in there as well. Our first fire card for him. For Scotty. Not bad. Not a bad start. Um, I think the fire one is clear as well, by the way. The fire one is way better than the ice version. Um, the fire one's actually not a terrible card. It's not insane, but it's not a terrible card. I think you could definitely... Like, my, my issue with these cards is there's really nowhere to use them, to be honest. I miss the old objectives, man. I really do. I miss the old objectives where you'd have to use a full Spanish team and icon shops and things like that. Because that was a lot of fun. And you get to use those like fire and ice cards and stuff that you've been storing in the club. But because there's no real place to use fun different teams nowadays and the tournaments don't really reflect having to use a different team. They're just fodder cards that stay in your club for a little while. It's kind of boring. I miss the old days. I really do. Um, double walkout in the 85 double is not bad. At least it's not two 85s. Uh, a little bit of fodder packs. A few fodder packs left, sorry. 83 times 10 and an 83 times 20. Come on. Versus cards, please. Thought was out, EA. Spanish. Striker. Who? Walk out. Oh! What? Whatever. Uh, Morata and Kavari Scalia. I was very confused for a second. Uh, it's a dupe as well. He's packed both versions of Morata so far, just like me. So, uh, you know. Welcome to the club of uh, Double Morata. Now an 83 times 20. Come on, EA. Cook right here. Cook for us. Inform again. It's going to be all black and an inform. Who's going to be in, Who's going to be the inform? Who's this, who is this week? week? Zalazar. I think that card actually looks all right, to be fair. Any, any versus cards in there? On the second page? Hey, at least you got one. Bad one, but at least you got one. All right, next two player picks. Here we go. Another fodder pick. Cola for fodder. Whatever. All right, come on. This is the one. I feel it in my bones. I'm disappointed. All right, next hero player pick. Come on. Paolo Fucci, I would take that. That is a W. How much is he worth these days, actually? Wow, he's actually cheaper than I thought he was, but that's a W. We take that. All right, we have two more 86 plus base hero picks because there's no triple threats in these. Berbatov, you take that. 
Well, you won't really. I think uh, Smaller X the, the pick there, to be honest. But I'd have picked Berbatov. All right, next one. Kiesler. She's okay. She's not bad. Or as some would say, Kebler. All right, my boy ruben has got a 75 plus player pick and then the hero pick. Oh, an 85 of Yager Aspas is a W in a 75 plus player pick, in my opinion. All right, come on. Give us a triple threat, please. No. Rui Costa, Melito, or Dudek. I'm struggling not to fall asleep. We're going to end off today's video with two more hero player picks on my uh, second account, and then maybe a store pack. I don't know if I've got the, the FC points on this account or not, to be honest. Uh, Rosicki, boring. I should have picked Oli, but, you know, whatever. And Joe Cole, actually, probably the best one we've had so far. Joe Cole, triple threat. About 300, 250k, four star, four stars. Actually, a really decent card. Annoyingly, on an account I don't use. Um, I don't have any FC points, and I can't be bothered to add any. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.